What's up my shuggies? Ashley here and in today's video I am so excited to be bringing another home goods queen home goods haul. I am so excited about this video because I happen to find so many good things that I decided that you guys probably and hopefully won't mind that I am doing a home goods haul two weeks in a row. If you didn't see my last video check it out down below. I will link it for you guys. I found some really good finds from home goods and of course I happened to be going to a couple of different locations and found some more amazing stuff that I am so excited to share with you guys. As always, I would like to welcome my new subscribers to the channel. Don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to this channel and also click that post notification bell so you guys can be notified every time I upload new videos. And if you are interested in seeing this amazing shop with me and haul of everything amazing from home goods, then just keep watching. <laughs> Before we get into the video, I would like to thank Skillshare for sponsoring this video. Skillshare is an online learning community with thousands of inspiring classes for creators to explore new skills, deepen existing passions, and getting lost in creativity. They have classes that include creative writing, animation, film and video, and marketing. A new class that was launched that I am super excited about taking is a class that's all about self-care that is taught by Jonathan Van Ness. Skillshare is curated specifically for learning, meaning there are no ads and they are always launching new premium classes. So you can stay focused and follow wherever your creativity takes you. The first 1,000 people to click the link in the description box will get a free one month trial of Skillshare. And without further ado, let's go ahead and get into the video. All right, you guys, it has been a little while since I've done a voiceover, so I wanted to talk about some of these beautiful items I found, including this desk at Home Goods. I saw a similar coffee table. It is gorgeous. They had a ton of accent chairs, but I am looking for a Sherpa accent chair. And this, you guys, is the exact one that I have from a year or so ago in my living room. I cannot believe it. I love it. $299. I love these vessels. They're just a little too green. This is a beautiful nightstand and another beautiful accent chair. Very nice and high-end looking. This is another little unique piece that I was trying to measure out from my project house that I loved. It's nice and rustic. And pompous grass is back at Home Goods. As always, coffee table books and this beautiful, I have this for my jewelry, this heart bowl, and it's huge. Tons and tons of horses, the distressed horses, and the storage, just like I said in my pantry. I love this. It's beautiful. And a Sarah Brooke piece that is on clearance. Are you ready for this? 190 bucks. Huge and totally worth it. This yellow mustard couch, not sure how I feel about it. And some nice accent pieces, including this adorable little black piece right here. Some kitchen utensil holders, I love them. And this distressed wood accent table, you can never go wrong with these. I put them everywhere. It was just a little expensive. Here is the other desk, it is in black, and I'm telling you they also have coffee tables that with the exact same design. They're so beautiful and they look so nice and high end. I love the detail. Some more accent chairs, except these are gray and not Sherpa and white. However, they were only 249 bucks. This adorable little mug holder, how cute is this? Very rustic and farmhouse looking. If you are into that sort of vibe, 12 bucks, 13 bucks, it's yours. Tons of black accents for the kitchen with wood, I love it. This is a great DIY project, $12.99. You can throw some baking soda paint on here and you're good to go. These beautiful cooking cookie sheets, cooking sheets, cooking pans, love them. Wood rings, can never go wrong with those. And these ginormous, massive beauties right here. Here's my girl. They have her in a couple of other colors. I have this in my guest bath and some more storage on the way out. I love these shower containers. And of course, I had to check out the pajama section. Some cute little matchy matchy shorts, a two pack. I think it was, yes, $9.99. Some cute shoes, 24 bucks. Love those with the studs. I have these, except they're a different style, and I love them. Super cute, I actually have two pairs of those, uh, the clear and the beige. And then look at this leather couch with little accent tables. 
massive fiddle leaf tree and of course I had to check out the pillows I love their pillows this one's only 19 bucks beautiful and my type of vibe love this wish I had room for it have these pillows but not this style black with beige and look at this blanket I wish I would have gotten them both so cute Ugg blankets love them lots of Middle Eastern designs so luxe and high-end looking and there's another little accent table some more dried grass oh my gosh fall is here even though it's 900 degrees here more pillows this massive I think it's a wine fridge I don't know and planters head planters I don't know how I feel about that either love this just wasn't big enough still searching for one for my entryway and another marble desk super cute very modern another little accent piece here very very nice very different and another fiddle leaf plant can never go wrong with those here are some more paintings very monochromatic white piece with a gold frame and I love this skinny 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 little bench all right, you guys, we are starting in the bathroom with this bad boy right here. And for those of you that have been following me for quite some time, I have seen the exact replica of this. It's actually at the project house that I have been working on. And it was literally almost two times the amount of money. It was actually, I think around $70. But I found this one at Home Goods. It's literally the exact same, exact same size, everything. It may have like a hair more um, dist uh, distressing on it, but other than that, it's the same. It is Mango Wood. It is by the brand. Um, it doesn't say here. It just says made in the Philippines. However, 39 bucks. Look how adorable this is. I love it. It is the perfect shape. It's like oval. The one end that I had in here before was from Target and they still do have that one. That one's considered the smaller one and I think that one is around $60. And so this is considered the taller or bigger one and this is around $70. So if you find these at Home Goods, they're definitely going to be cheaper. The big one is um, $39 like I showed you and I have seen the smaller one too. I believe it's around $30. So definitely a money saver right there if you're into that. And I love the way that it just kind of brings the black um, hooks and curtain rod together. And it is literally the perfect accessory for a bathroom. So if you are into remodeling your bathroom and you are in need of something like that, then definitely check them out. They had a ton of other like natural wood colors as well, um, some different materials as well, but definitely something that I think is perfect for bathroom decor. Moving to the other side, speaking of bathroom decor, I found these really amazing um, toilet paper holders. So pre-existingly, the toilet paper holder was here, but really wanted to keep this wall open because I have the towels right there. So what I did was took it off the wall. As you can see the little, I still have to kind of go over it with some paint, but I took it off the wall there and instead got this bad boy right here. Super cute, modern and sleek. I actually ended up getting two of them. So what I did was I went around to all of my bathrooms and for the bathrooms that I felt the pre-existing toilet paper holder fit, I left it. I just painted it for those walls that had something on them and I felt like it was an obstruction and I didn't like it, then I went with this option. So I ended up getting two of these and then the other two bathrooms I left and just painted the pre-existing toilet paper holder, but it's super nice and sturdy, extremely heavy. And I believe it was $14.99. I was going to say 19, but I was wrong. $14.99, super sleek and black. If you are not into black, they did have a matte silver and one other color I cannot remember off the top of my head but really nice very clean modern sleek I love it it fits perfect in this space and this is a little bit of a tight corner um, because it butts up to the shower so definitely keep your eyes peeled I have not seen good toilet paper holders from home kids in a really long time I've been looking a long time for these so definitely go and snag some they had a ton at the location I was at which was the Winter Park location. The next item I wanted to talk about, not this right here, but this right here, this beautiful little carafe. I have, it looks like 
uh, disgusting, but I promise it's not. It's fresh juice. I try to juice um, or make juice once or twice a week, and it is jimber, jimber? No, ginger, lemon, and in this one I added some carrot, but I needed a good carafe to kind of shake it up because anyone that juices knows that it can get um, separated. And of course, it has a little black aesthetic to it. It just has a nice solid lid, and you pop the top and pour it out. And I use my beautiful color changing mugs from um, Costco to make the juice and drink it while I am at work. So if you are looking for an organizational tool that is also aesthetically pleasing and literally so good and purposeful, and you don't want something glass like this, then I definitely would recommend getting one of these. It's plastic, um, you can rinse it out, wash it, and you are good to go. It's safe, easy. Obviously, this is a great alternative as well, um, but a lot of people don't like glass pitchers um, or carafes. They just want something plastic that's easy, whether it's kids or whatever the case may be. So if that is something that you are in need of, um, definitely check these out. I think it was maybe 4 or $5. It was super inexpensive as well. Oh, $4.99. I didn't even take the sticker off. <laughs> so I will see if I can find something similar to link below for you guys because I absolutely love it. And I'll probably get more and put um, my juices in there as well. Next, we have this bad boy right here. I happened to find this on a whim. And you guys, I think it is the most classic, beautiful, luxe looking tray ever. Uh, I only have one geode in the middle. <laughs> However, I'm hoping to find some more. But for now, this is what I have. But I love it. I think it was around 29 bucks. I'm sure I still have the tag on the bottom. It has these beautiful, like, brushed, vintage-looking metal handles on the side. And it is a nice white wash or gray wash finish. I think it pairs perfectly in this room because there are a lot of gold accents, the knobs on this console right here. And I get a ton of questions about this. This is actually from Home Goods as well. I got this forever ago. I think it was even broken if I remember correctly, but I do love the little bit of gold accents we have. We also have the gold accents on this nightstand um, with the legs and the little bit of hardware on the drawers. So definitely love incorporating little pops of that. And I think on top of that black console, it just really pops and looks really nice. Um, I'd love to get some more geodes to fill that up, similar to the one that I have in my living room, but it's just one of my new favorite pieces that I found Found. you know sometimes when you go you hit the jackpot and you feel like you just get a classic piece like this that you'll keep forever and this really is that for me um, dimension wise I would say it's about 14 to 15 inches and again the price point was not bad I believe it's around I'm pretty sure 24 or 29 bucks next we are in the upstairs bathroom if you've been following me on Instagram I've been working on this bathroom for some time now and it is finally almost finished um, but I did want to show you two things and first is this adorable little soap dispenser it is super similar or actually looks the exact same as the uh, trash cans that I have they are the same material I have one black and one white and it's just got that cute little wood accent on the bottom I love it because it fits perfectly on this little riser I don't know if I have mentioned this or shown this before if not, let's talk about it. It's adorable. I've seen these in multiple sizes. It is a beautiful white washed stressed little wood riser. It was only $9.99 and it fits perfectly in this corner to put soap, candles, uh, lotion, whatever you want to put, cotton balls, anything on this. It fits perfectly in this bathroom on top of this vanity and I love the way that it looks. Next up is this Mirror OMG. This was a gem find that I found. I was just running through the other day and happened to see it and thought this would be perfect for my bathroom. It was a little tedious getting that thing hung because it's extremely heavy and it barely fits in the space as you can see here. So I can't move um, back that much further. However, I will try to uh, move back as much as I can to show you guys. Um, but I love it. It is a black uh, mirror. It has got nice rounded edges and this beautiful detailing. It is made of um, a wood type material. 
and I think it was $120. It is by the brand domain. So all of you who were looking, uh, including me for those restoration hardware mirrors, the same one that's in my beauty room with the scroll on top, uh, it's by the same exact brand name as that company. They have some really gorgeous mirrors. So if you ever are in the mirror section at Home Goods and you see domain, it's a really good high quality brand name. I actually had someone comment that um, I believe they sell those I think she said California and they were like a really nice high-end brand so definitely quality definitely nice luxurious high-end looking to dress up a bathroom if you are trying to redo yours or just spruce it up a little bit these are a really good affordable way to do that and while we're here I will show you that is the exact same toilet paper holder that I showed you guys downstairs it is so nice and so high-end i absolutely love it this was the other bathroom that i decided to put one in because toilet paper holder it was right here as you can see those two little spots if you stare really hard super inconvenient with that um little stool in the way so i decided you know what i'm just going to take it off and because there's too much of a distance there i didn't want to attach it to the cabinet so i thought that was a perfect alternative and of course it ties in with the little black accents all throughout this bathroom so definitely something that I love. I may do another something here and then I'm working on a DIY here. So we're still working, but we are like 95% of the way done with this beautiful bathroom. So don't forget to check out Domain. They have some amazing mirrors from Home Goods. Next is something that you guys are really missing out on. If you don't know about this, it is so good. This is my, I think, second bottle, and it is the Method Granite Cleaner. Not that I have granite, but I just love the way that it smells. It is, oh, it actually says granite, marble, and stone. But it's orange tangerine. That's what I love about it. I've seen this at Target before, and they sell it for $3.99, which is, I think, around the same thing. It's just easier more convenient for me to get at home goods um because they're always out of it at target so three dollars and 99 cents it's so good i love it i got i think three of them when i saw them at home goods the other day i just grabbed them and threw all that they had in my cart but it really is um, a nice cleaner and it has a really beautiful clean smell to it so if you were into that um, I also love the Windex, but the yellow one, the antibacterial, but just for something different, if I'm just doing like a dust cleanup, then I'll use this on the countertops as well. So definitely check this brand out. They have some really great smelling cleaning products. And moving on to my newest, most favorite place in the whole entire house, my new pantry. This is not a reveal. I just wanted to show you guys. If you do follow me on Instagram, you will know I spent all weekend working on this with my dad and my husband and my mom so shout out to them for helping me with this beauty it is not finished there are some patch holes that still need work and some trim work that needs work but I don't care because I love it so much it is so amazing if you have not invested in doing this in your pantry I'm telling you it's totally worth it but we are not here for the pantry. We are here for the baskets. That's another video. This big basket or box up here. It is beautiful and ginormous. I found this at Home Goods recently. I love this because I found it to match these baskets that I got recently from Target that I talked about on my home haul. And these are my new favorite baskets. They are by the brand just says made by design uh, it's a steel basket but I love the little wood accents I can link these below for you but like I said I love those baskets I saw this it is perfect because it matches it with the wood top and the plastic side and I love that it's not see-through so I can store everything ugly up there and hide it away like all of my extra uh, not matching napkins or paper plates or whatever the case may be these are great for that and like I said I love that they match these baskets so I'm trying to incorporate a little bit more of the clear uh, and white and then just a touch of wood aesthetic to this um, pantry. So if you're into organization or any of that stuff, definitely do not miss out on Home Goods because they have some really, really good stuff. They also have those clear ones that I ended up using in the project house that used to be in this pantry. Um, they're clear with the wood top that are also amazing for storage. But like I said, I wanted a little bit more white. So really love that as well as this bad boy boy right here and omg this was probably too expensive however 
I love it. It has got the most heavy high-end weight to it you have ever seen in your life. It has a little bread logo. It's a beautiful buttery white color and of course you ugh, store inside your bread. I, I don't know if anybody knows what the heck this is for. Do you cut your bread on it? I don't know why it has these um, notches in it, but I'm telling you I have never seen something so high-end from home goods in my life um, but I have my tortillas in here and then just my fresh bread um, so far no molding issues I was a little bit worried about that but there is a little um, hole in here so like I said if somebody is more familiar with these than me please let me know am I doing this right should I unwrap the bread am I messing everything up I'm not sure I just know that I love it I know that it is extremely heavy extremely expensive but it is the most beautiful thing I seriously have ever seen it's like I don't know it's just like the quintessential bread organizer uh the only other ones I've ever seen of these were like the little tin ones and I just when I saw this I fell in love so let me know if you know anything about these in the comments um down below and yeah if you see it I know you're gonna jump at the price but I'm telling you it's something you can keep forever and it will match any aesthetic farmhouse modern traditional whatever the case may be it is beautiful and again matches all of the white and wood aesthetics we're going for in this beautiful pantry also stay tuned i'm going to do a complete reveal of this pantry when it's finished all right you guys that is going to wrap up this video i hope you guys enjoyed it as always I will link everything that I can that is similar in the description box down below and keep those fingers crossed for quarter four for home goods to still be launching their online platform. Please don't forget to like this video, subscribe to my channel and hit that post notification bell so you guys can be notified every time I upload new videos and I will see you guys in my next one. Bye.